The decline in Bitcoin cost Tesla, MicroStrategy, and Block around $5 billion. Welcome to CryptoLink channel. If you love getting news and updates about cryptocurrency, join our community by subscribing to our channel. You can tap the bell icon to never miss our new videos. If you enjoy our channel, kindly like and share it with your friends. July 21, 2022. A tweet from Bloomberg Crypto stating that Tesla, MicroStrategy and Block lost about $5 billion from the drop in Bitcoin. Tesla Incorporated, MicroStrategy Incorporated, and Block Incorporated, that were once high flyers on the stock market, saw a $5 billion combined loss on their Bitcoin holdings in the second quarter as if the situation weren't already challenging enough. The value drop is due to the cryptocurrency's price plummeting by 59% in the three weeks leading up to June 30. Bloomberg determined the loss using the firm's prior statements on their Bitcoin holdings. For MicroStrategy and Block, such losses are merely on paper until they sell, but Tesla has locked in a portion of the decline, the automaker sold most of its Bitcoin during the quarter, and an impairment affected earnings, it said on Wednesday. Let's now discuss the crypto royalty. About 85% of the Bitcoin held by publicly traded companies is owned by MicroStrategy, Tesla, and Block. The toll highlights the risk faced by businesses who chose to store some of their corporate treasury in volatile cryptocurrency as opposed to more secure short-term treasuries or cash. There is no assurance that Bitcoin will ever return to its November high of about $68,000, even though it has slightly recovered from its low last month of around $18,000. Buying Bitcoin, an incredibly volatile asset that puts the company's funds at danger of significant losses, is extremely risky for businesses, based on the statement of Jerry Klein, a managing director of Treasury Partners, a New York company that manages funds for businesses. According to CoinGecko, at least 27 publicly traded firms have Bitcoin listed on their balance sheet. The majority of them are Bitcoin miners and financial services companies, however more than 85% of the Bitcoins acquired by publicly traded corporations were with the software developer MicroStrategy, the automaker Tesla, and the payments processor block. The holdings increase the risk for investors on top of the already volatile equities. Rising interest rates, soaring inflation, and the possibility of a recession have all impacted their stock prices. While Block and MicroStrategy have both lost close to half of their value this year, Tesla's stock has fallen 30%. Large Bitcoin supporters run each of the three businesses. One of the riskiest decisions was done by MicroStrategy CEO Michael Saylor, whose business spent roughly $4 billion to purchase 129,699 Bitcoins. The token's value decreased by $3.4 million for the second quarter as a result of the price change. After Saylor criticized the typical approach of investment in short-term U.S. government securities when returns fell and added that inflation would make cash useless, the software business became the first public corporation to invest the majority of its treasury in Bitcoin in 2020. Early last year, Elon Musk's Tesla purchased $1.5 billion of the cryptocurrency and promptly sold part of that stock at a profit. Musk stated that the cryptocurrency was a positive thing and was about to get wide support by traditional financial experts at that time. According to Musk on a Wednesday earnings conference, it sold 75% of its remaining stakes in the second quarter because it didn't know how much longer the COVID lockdowns in China would persist and needed to have more cash on hand. In Shanghai, the firm has a plant. He said that future increases in our Bitcoin holdings are undoubtedly an option for us, therefore, this should not be interpreted as a judgment on Bitcoin. Tesla hasn't sold any of its holdings of another token, Dogecoin. As of 9.35 am, Bitcoin was down 2.2% at $22,725. New York, where? According to a corporate statement, Block, managed by Twitter co-founder and Bitcoin enthusiast Jack Dorsey, acquired $366 million worth of the cryptocurrency as of March 31. On August 2 and August 4, respectively, investors will be monitoring MicroStrategy and Block's results to see how much of a write-down each company takes on its assets. 
Bloomberg calculations place the cumulative paper losses for the three businesses at roughly $5 billion when marking up Tesla's estimated assets and Square's share at the June 30 cryptocurrency market price of approximately $18,731. MicroStrategy accounts for almost 70% of that. Tesla, MicroStrategy, and Block's representative all refused to comment on the business's Bitcoin holdings, and neither company returned our requests for comment. Considering how far Bitcoin has fallen, I believe the businesses that have it will make an effort to keep on to it, however, if it experiences another significant downward run, they could be obliged to sell it as a result of margin calls, stated Matt Maley, Miller Tabak Plus Company's chief market strategist. This year, investors have turned away from unsustainable growth firms, favoring Tesla, the most valuable automaker in the world and the only US EV company that is profitable. After releasing second-quarter profits that above Wall Street expectations on Thursday, Tesla's share price increased by as much as 5%. In the meantime, the stock of Rivian has lost over two-thirds of its worth, and Nikola Corporation and Lucid Group Incorporated have both fallen by approximately 40% this year. Let me now show you a tweet from Dogecoin developers. Hashtag Dogecoin Core 1.14.6 is now released, live and current. With a good number of improvements under the hood and some nice new features in the UI. Get it here github.com slash dogecoin slash dogec. This is definitely a recommended update for everyone. After an upgrade, Dogecoin's Doge trading has become volatile. Important security fixes and network efficiency modifications are included in the minor version release. Added transaction download system reliability and adjustments to alert messages are security-related enhancements that let developers retrieve previous transactions. The suggested dust limit for each user on the Dogecoin network was lowered from 1 Doge to 0.01 Doge as part of the update. The minimal quantity of money required to conduct a transaction on the chain is indicated by thresholds called dust limitations that are embedded in the Dogecoin network. The ability to see whether transactions are stalled, unmined, or not in the mempool, a holding area for transactions that are awaiting mining into blocks, is another feature of wallet operators. This stops the node from giving out missing or outdated transactions. More precise control over the node's network capacity is made possible by another wallet-related patch that enables node managers to alter the max number of the connections their node permits without having to restart. Based on developer docs, the chain may now be rescanned by node operators for wallet transactions starting at a specific height using the new remote procedure call method rescan. The developers provided clarification in the release that it might provide a quicker rescan for keys whose generation date or block height is known. In the previous day, trade in the native Doge coins of Dogecoin was erratic. Prices decreased by almost 9%, virtually completely reversing the profits from Tuesday's rally as traders grabbed profits. The tokens are, nevertheless, up 11% for the week. Regardless of price volatility, liquidations of $5 million were seen in Dogetrack futures, indicating that spot trading was primarily responsible for the movements. That's it for our today's video. So, what can you say about the news? Let us know about it in the comments section down below. Thanks for tuning in to CryptoLink. We are always excited to provide you with news and updates about cryptocurrency and if you like this video, please click the like button. See you on the next one.